Next, we are going to learn about the fifth table. Okay, so next one is the fifth table. So what are the methods we have uh, uh, read the fifth table uh, using the which method we have uh, read it? We have uh, read it the, with the help of the clock I have told you. Because what is the reason why, why I have chosen the clock means of course the multiplication and tables will be introduced at the end of the first standard or the starting of the second standard before the first standard ending of the first standard and starting of starting seven second standard you all you all be very cleared with the clock because i know the syllabus will fully covered uh, the clock so how the clocks works how the clocks works you see 12 3, 6 and 9, 2, 4, 5, 7, 8, 10, 11. How the clock works? There is a small hand and a big hand, isn't it? There is a small hand and a big hand. A small hand will denote the what? Denote the hours and the big hand will denote the, uh, denotes the minutes. So, however, it's not at all problem. For example, here the, uh, the small hand shows the number 1. So, 1 hour. And if you want to calculate the minutes, you want to be skipped by count by 5, 5, 5, isn't it? Five, uh, sorry, no, 5, 10, 15, 20. So, you are using the same method is going to be used in the 5 tables also. So, as like what is a 1 into 5 is equal to 5. 2 into 5 is equal to 10, 3 into 5 is equal to 15, 4 into 5 is equal to 20, 5 into 5 is equal to 25, 6 into 5 is equal to 30, 7 into 5 is equal to 35, 8 into 5 is equal to 40, 9 into 5 is equal to 45, 10 into 5 is equal to 50. So, so these are the 5 tables. Using the clock you can recollect the 5 table actually. Okay. So you have a question. So how can I remember the clock? So there is a no other way. You have to use the skip counting method. Skip count by 5. You have to be very follow. So how can I recollect skip count by 5 method means? Yes, of course, I have told you the lot of tips and tricks to recollect or to get a memorize about skip count by 5 method. And it is a very simpler when comparing to skip count by 4, when comparing that the skip count by 5 is a very simpler. So what, why I am saying of skip, uh, simpler means? Yes, of course, we are going to start with the 5. That's not a problem. 10, next that is where there will be the Two times the one will become, two times the two will become, two times three will become, two times four will become. So one time we are going to put one one here zero and five again two two zero and five three three zero and five four four zero and five. So this is the very simplest um, skip count by method. So no other uh, technique or to count that no need to do such a kind of very difficult task. It will be very easier to learn the five tables. Okay.